were many challenges throughout the COVID-19 pandemic from a staffing point of view, where there were various challenges in relation to communication with all of our staff members working from home. From a managerial programme point of view, there were many challenges with the adaptations of our programmes and the cancellation of residentials, um, which means we had to sort of adapt the programme to, to make sure we were compliant with COVID-19 guidelines. The biggest problem from a Premier League Primary Stars point of view would be the inconsistency of delivery. So for example, not being able to do numerous sessions ongoing. So it might be that we do four sessions and then we miss one due to classes going back into bubbles. It might be that we have a Premier League Primary Stars tournament then gets cancelled due to um, COVID-19 spikes within the community. So that would be our biggest challenge. So the young people that I interact with are most worried about inconsistency in delivery again. Um, this therefore means that I feel their confidence is being impacted. Um, we find that they don't want to do as much, they don't want to do those after school clubs, they don't want to do um, as much extracurricular activity because of their confidence has been impacted from being indoors for so long. The ongoing concerns that we're hearing from young people is around the sort of behaviour of groups of young people. Um, this may be due to a lack of social contact um, over the past couple of years leading to poor behaviour in, in schools and on the street. I think the proudest moment for me would be a Premier League Primary Stars tournament. We took a school from Vista over to the regional finals with over 500 children there. Um, and to see all the children there participate in the sport that they love after being away from it for so long, I think really made the staff and everyone involved proud. So as the organisation grows and we go into more primary schools, uh, and impact even more members of the community right from the top of the county in Banbury all the way down to the south of the county, employing more members of staff and having a positive impact throughout. We're extremely excited for the future of Oxford United, the community, as we continue to grow throughout Oxfordshire and ultimately reach more people and our projects will only get bigger and bigger. The future of youth work is bright. <laughs>